my name is Shay. I'm a senior reporter and I'm here with Hi, my name is Michelle Franzen. I'm the children's librarian at the Fairfield Civic Center Library. And we're here at Harry Potter Family Festival. What are we doing here today? Well, today we wanted to have a big event where we got to try different STEM, um, different STEM activities, but we also thought that you know, library-related people love Harry Potter, so we wanted to combine both Harry Potter and STEM together and do lots of activities for all different ages. Can you tell me a little bit about yourself? Uh, about myself? Well, let's see. I worked here for about three years. I've been children's librarian for almost one. Originally, I'm from Illinois, and I moved here uh, a couple years ago, and I've, I've worked in libraries almost 12 years. What inspired you to do this? What inspires me to do this? The program okay. or just being a librarian? Um, a, a librarian. Mm -hmm. Well, when I was a kid, I really liked going to the library, and I read all the time. But when I got older in college, I worked in a children's library, and I got to help with the programming, got to help with the books, got to help people find things, and I found that I really helped, I really enjoyed working with people. And part of the library is you're helping people find the information that they need for their enjoyment and for learning. And I really wanted to do that as my career. Where we can find you on the internet? The library's website is solanolibrary.com. Thank you for your time. Bye. Thank you so much. I'm here with. Uh, my name is Jacob. Hi, I'm a volunteer. What is, what is this place right here? Uh, this is the uh, Invisibility Cloak uh, Steam Challenge. Uh, we're using the idea of the Invisibility Cloak from uh, Harry Potter, along with this infrared camera we have to kind of uh, do some science experiments with it. So what inspires you to do all this to uh, volunteer? Oh, um, I know people who work at the library. I'm good friends with them, and they said they were doing this Harry Potter event. And I said, yeah, I'd love to come help out. Thank you for your time. Bye. It's, um, it's a pretty... Oh, is, it, is it not black anymore? It's, it's it is. Black. Oh, okay. I like blue, sorry. Oh, no, 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 no. Because, I mean, it's starting to melt. It's going to start turning blue, not black. But uh, you'll notice the darker things are, the colder they are. So now grab the bottle with your hand. No, 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 the ice part. And hold it there for a few moments. Or until it gets too cold. Good? Right, now take a look at your hand with the camera. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Now your hand's cold. Like cold? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, right. Like your hand's turning invisible. Um, no? Right. Watch what happens when I turn it towards your body. I can see it. Now you can see it, I turn it. Visible. Mm -hmm. That's because this material, this mylar material, reflects your body's heat, even from a distance. So. Mm -hmm. As long as it's not reflecting anybody's body heat, you can't see it. Ready? Okay. You're going to need a volunteer for this one so you can see it. You want me? Yep. Or D or D. You want to try? Covering you up. So, can you see them with the camera? Yes. Can you see them? Yes. Alright, we're going to use this visibility cloak. Ready? Wow. Okay. Yeah. Alright, Dean. 